Guys, it is beer o'clock on Ginger Beer and today we are reviewing something a little bit different. We are reviewing a magic beer. Check this out. Absolutely complete balance. This magic beer has been sent to me without the person knowing how magic it was. Bella Scudding sent me this Little did she know, it was a tin of magic beer. It is balancing there. Look at that for balance. Absolutely amazing. Fantastic. Thank you, Bella, for this tin of magic beer, which is real struggle to balance right on my nose. But I'm managing to do it. Oh, nearly dropped it. There you go. Guys, cheers. Let's go drink some beers. <laughs> Guys, it's beer o'clock on Ginger Beer and today we are reviewing a beer that's been sent in to me. Fantastic. This is a tin from Innis and Gun. It is their Session IPA coming in at 4.6 in a 330ml tin. And look at the design on that. I like the colours on that one. Thank you very much to Bella Scadding who has saved up her pocket money it seems and sent this beer in to me. I think probably mummy or daddy had something to do with it. But Bella, thank you very much. That's very kind of you. We'll see what this beer is like. Well, I say we. I'll see what this beer is like. You leave it a few years before you have a beer. It doesn't taste that nice. All right. But Bella apparently likes watching the videos. And I didn't mention her the other day on another video. So hence, I've got a beer. If that's the case, then I'll never mention it in anybody. And then everybody will send me beers. Winner! No? Okay. So, we've got a tin of Innis and Gun Session IPA coming in at 4.6%, 330ml tin. Told you all of that. Let's get it out of the tin, into the glass, see what it's like. There we go. Give that an open. Lovely bit of smoke on that. Coming off, you may have even picked up on it a wee bit. Hopefully. So... Looks good. Let's get it out of the tin, into the glass. Lovely. Right. Okay. Change of hands as usual. We have got a gorgeous, a gorgeous, nice, clear, golden body on the beer. A little bit of chill haze there on the glass uh, and a nice two finger white head to the top. Uh, the body is lovely and clear. I didn't expect it to be as clear as it was. For an IPA, yeah, for a session IPA 4.6 all sounds pretty, pretty good. Look at that. Lovely. Let's see what it's like on the aroma. Okay. It smells lovely. It smells nice and fresh. Wow, that's really, really malty and hoppy at the same time. It's got a good, strong malt smell coming through, but you can also get evidence of the hops in it. I didn't expect it to be both. It's a little bit sort of light citrus, I would say. There's a little bit of lemon there. There's definitely some orange in it. I'm getting that straight away. Right, okay, it's making my mouth water. It looks lovely in the glass. So, let's get it into the, into the, into the mouth. Let's, let's, let's drink it. Let's, let's go for it. Let's try it out. Cheers, everybody, and cheers, Bella. I'm going in again. Okay. Totally inoffensive beer, that. 
that's lovely and fresh. 4.6, it's a good session beer. You could quaff that all day. If you were going to a barbecue or a party or something and that was there, you would happily drink that all day. Uh, yeah, it's... It is, you can taste the malt in it, like I said on the aroma, you can get the malt. Um, there's a bitter taste on it, right to begin with, it's quite bitter, uh, but that does give way a little bit. And there is definitely orange in it, as I said with the aroma again, you get that orange aftertaste coming through. But it is a clean taste, uh, it's alright, it's okay, it's quite light. Drink that, drink that with a lamb tikka gel frazy all night. I reckon that is cracking. I like that. A very, very inoffensive, nice beer. Very nice. I like it. Thank you very much, Bella. That's very kind of you. Uh, I'm enjoying that. I'll have to remember to not drink it all before I take a photograph for the Instagram account. But that's a good one. Uh, not sure where it came from. I think probably what it was. It's in stock in one of the supermarkets. And I've got a feeling it may be Morrison's that at the moment are doing a... Now I'm going to say Morrison's are doing a beer festival, but I don't think this was. No, this wasn't Morrison's. That's somebody else I'm thinking of. Um, so I'm not sure where this one came from, but I'm sure it is readily available. But that is really worth trying. It's, get a couple of tins of that in your fridge. Um, it's a great beer to pull out and offer people if you've got them coming around or something. Um, Lovely, I like it, I like it. I certainly love the colours, the colours on it are lovely, aren't they? Look at that, all the way round. So guys, as usual, please uh, follow and like my Facebook page. Uh, so make sure you do. If you've got friends that are into their beers, then please share these videos with them. As I always say, there's far too many beers to be drinking alone, so please do. Um, like my Facebook page, drop me a line, let me know what you are drinking uh, and if you've tried any of the beers that I have reviewed, if you agree or disagree with my reviews, perhaps there's ones that I've slated and you like them, perhaps there's ones that you've tried I like that you don't like, that's what makes it good fun about beers, so let me know. Um, and also make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, ginger beer beer review so find well you've obviously found it because you're watching this but make sure you subscribe click on the bell it will notify you every time we post something fresh find me on instagram under ginger underscore beer underscore beer underscore review ginger beer beer review where i post all of the pictures of the beers unless i drink them first now like this one uh, as i'm reviewing them but make sure you do the whole lot if you have a look up on the facebook page a few postings above there is a competition running at the moment so you can win some beer Bella unfortunately you have to be over 18 to win the beer so you can't uh, uh, enter the competition but daddy could or mummy so get them to do it all right uh, and that's about it I think guys have a great week there'll be another review soon Bella again thank you for the beer that's very kind of you uh, and I'll see you all soon cheers guys cheers Bella